stepping aside, had to take out Book, who you just saw go home, who lost to AK. AK took out iMusician, as well as John Ding to get here, a teeth butt down on that loser's side as well. But look at the chaos, look at the mayhem of the LCQ and the representation as well. I feel like it's been a good time all across the board, but here we are. <laughs> Hundreds Grand of players, finals. and we're down to two. And only one of these players will be living to see tomorrow, Sunday, our finals day, where they're going to fight against 19 of the other best players from around the world. It's any, crazy. Any, any predictions here? Well, you gotta, you, I don't know how many shirts you have left, but any predictions? <laughs> here, here's, the, here's the one thing about this, right? AK started this top 32 in losers because of Bilal. They were in the same pool. Yeah. Mm. And Bilal beat him 2 1. So it's. You know, AK had to work that entire top 32 just to get his run back. Yes, and again, just like Evo Japan, it's Philippines versus Pakistan, man. Oh, it is. Yeah, yeah. you're right. But this, but this time, the roles are on, yeah, the, on the loser side. And you know, I feel like AK, and especially, you know, this is kind of the general thing is that I feel like when players are playing in the loser's bracket and doing well, they can carry that momentum with them. Yeah. And usually just carry it all the way. But right now, both of these guys are on winning momentum. Bilal hasn't lost, and AK hasn't lost since losing to Bilal in pools. Yeah. But he's been on a tear, and Bilal right now has been, maybe he's a little bit cold now, he's been sitting back. Right. But this time he has not gone for the Akuma mirror. He is locked in with Shaheen here versus Bilal. Grand finals time here, Pakistan versus Philippines. This is going to be a great one, man. All right, guys, pop quiz, hot shots. This goes for the people at home to stream. Make some noise if you want Bilal to take grand finals. That goes for you guys out there, too. Okay. Pretty okay. good, right. pretty, pretty good. good. But if you guys would like AK to take grand finals, stream, crowd, make some noise. That's definitely loud. That's a lot of love out there. That's a lot of love out there. Thanks for participating, guys. There's definitely a few people that are screaming for both. But anyway, let's get into it. <laughs> I mean, sometimes you gotta, you know, you gotta fill in both A and B on the bubble and then hope that the, the, the you know, the scanner doesn't read it. Right. <laughs> Not my fault. I didn't understand the question. All right, nice adjustment there with the combo. <laughs> you guys, are I you? didn't understand the question. That was sick. Oh man. A quick start from both guys. AK with the slight life lead here. Uh, yeah, I can keep talking. <laughs> All right, you, you get you get the base, right? You get the drop right now. So good. Oh, wow. the quick punish okay. on the down four. AK jog first blood here in the matchup again. AK yeah. has to win two sets. That's yes. not going to be easy, right? Bilal has gone through almost every. Actually, he's gone through every opponent that he's faced thus far. Yes. He's on the winner side. So if you guys are not familiar, because AK is coming from the loser side, he needs to win two first to threes here, and he's well on his way here with one round. Has a lot of momentum as well from all these loser bracket matches. Good combo here. Mm. Great carry as well. Gets more away. Oh, I like it. Just I like jumps it. Over. Anything you can do, I can do better. I can jump too, bro. I love this patience so far from Bilal. And the most impressive thing about AK has been his whip punishing so far. Yeah. yeah. His ability just to land certain moves, I mean, whether it's down forward two or even the hop kick, it's just impeccable. Mm. I feel like one of the things that's made him better overall as a player is his pacing. That's, that lets him know when to pull the trigger and be like, yo, I'm going to go for slides over and over. I'm going to go for these hop kicks over and over. Yeah. And we've already seen some very, very strong Oh my god, he got him with well. the roll. So triple demon flip? Nice. Yeah, not much time left on the yeah. clock there. Bilal answers back with one second left, one yeah. round apiece. Yeah, like I said, there's a lot of strong Akuma players that I saw today from the Philippines as well. So it's not that they haven't got practice. AK will have practice versus the character. He also uses the character, of course, as well. But Bilal with two bars of meter to work with. Can't use him while you're getting comboed, though. <laughs> Big damage on the wall. Nice, he tried to catch him. Oh, wow. and there it is. But the range again, he did dash in. Yeah. Oh, he still got him, though. Three to close out, AK. Man, this is going to be a close one. I feel it. Yeah. And Bilal, it seems like he's just trying to make get to this wall. Yeah. Put some pressure on AK. You're gonna have to try and punish AK for using those down four twos as well. You know, use the standing to stop him from using that. And now, I mean, think about it like this: AK playing Akuma now. I feel like his understanding of this matchup just took on a whole new. Oh meaning, hell right? yeah! Yeah. Oh, oh my God! My God. Oh, oh, drops it. That could have been dead. Oh, but this, this might nice. be that's that's right. Range, right? Yep. Yeah. All right, drawing first blood, AK able to take match number one. Things that, seem to be in his favor. And that's a very good example of why you need to finish your combos. And I know Kuma's combos are very hard, but that would have been the round there for Bilal. Instead, AK gets the match first blood on the board. Now, what does Bilal do here? Does he 
Go straight in. I mean, he's got a. I think he's he in just, winners, man. So. I think he just hit straight rematch. Okay, yeah. Uh, never mind. <laughs> oh no, he's, 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 he's flagging him. Right. He wants to change. He wants to change. And that was uh, another thing. I feel like even though he also plays Akuma, I feel like he's been using Akuma to kind of get a feel, right? I feel like it's a great check to temperature, you know, character. Like, you know what? This guy's strong, but I'm really good too. Let me see how they deal with this Akuma stuff. Like, that's a thing that I felt like AK has done amazingly so far this weekend. And look at where it's got, it's gotten to this grand finals in the LCQ. One of the hardest Tekken tournaments ever, you know? Yeah. Like, those things mean a lot because we're looking at the highest possible play for Tekken right now and this is the person that's turning around he has a new character with Akuma and look at his understanding of a, a problem matchup for the world yeah. you know definitely definitely man you guys have done their homework man they're not messing about here they came here to win and you know for this kind of tournament you know even in the finals tomorrow let's say that, they, that AK does win or whoever wins you know you're gonna find Akuma oh, yeah. there's gonna oh, be yeah. an Akuma so you have to have done your homework it looks like they did as well He's yeah, I'm actually to proud of the entire community. It looks like a lot of people did do their homework, at least in the matchup. I mean, Japan came in hard. They yeah. were able to be, you know, one of the best Akuma players in Atif. Yes. And it's uh, just insane to see. I mean, even iMusician, he, I mean, iMusician's a special case, right? Yeah, yeah. He's, uh, he's a special player. I mean, only Yoshimitsu at that level, I would say. Mm, for sure, yeah. All right, so it looks like character select here for Valau. Is he going to go to the Brian? Oh, it looks like he is. Yeah. It looks like the set is changing even faster than I thought it would. Yes. After one match already, we see this matchup. I expected, you know, honestly, I expected to see Akuma Akuma early on. Yeah. But I don't think he wants to wait until the second set to actually make the change. Maybe he's trying to think of what works. I want to know yeah. what works yeah. and what doesn't work early on. Yeah, make him bleed close. early. You make close. him bleed you, you early. Don't wanna, you don't want to drag this out, especially with the way AK is playing. I feel like he's speed running now. Like, he's yeah. playing so many matches now. You yeah. know he's more than warmed up. He's already fought you once. Mm. He has an Akuma, and now you're switching characters, and he has to play from loser's side. AK is looking good, dude. Definitely. But yep. Bilal is... Uh, but Blau in the same regard, right? We've seen him make some clutch comebacks, and he's a thinker. He'll take the time in between that match to yeah. make sure he understands what's going on and make the character switch if need be. And there's Ooh. Brian. Look at that sidestep with the down forward two as well. We saw it do it versus Book as well. You're gonna get the corner pressure here. Oh, takes the Oki instead. Mm. Nice. Wall. Nice little conversion there. Ooh. Ooh. Doesn't try to go for it. Yeah. Wow. wow! Just does it. Yeah, just throws it out. I like yeah. that. Just kind of had a feeling. Like you're gonna, you're gonna step in right now. Let yeah, me, AK me... has a lot of confidence in his in his ability to download timing as well. It looks like you know he's been catching people with down for two a lot. And there, he's just like you know what? I know you're gonna come in. Yeah, he's definitely that kind of player. Where it feels like you know it feels like he's just throwing things out, but it's not that. It's, he he has a feeling that you're gonna step in right there. Yes. I mean, it should be noted. That, I mean. AK very comfortable in this matchup. I mean, he's played against some of the best Brian players in both Mr. Naps and uh, and Nia as well. And he was able to beat him, right? Wow, yeah. Yeah, Bilal's, you know, even though his Akuma has been really strong he, lately, just in the top eight, it feels like he's been using a lot of, a lot of Brian. Mm. He did say to me that if the Akuma didn't work, you know, he'd go to Brian when he needs to, but look at that! Jeez, wow. he just went up and did it. I yeah. can't believe yeah. that landed. Four back two out in the open, why not? And that's the thing, is when AK starts doing things like that, when he starts playing with that level or that aura of disrespect, he's in a good position. He's feeling himself. Yes. Mm. Look at that, see? Sure. He's feeling himself right now. Yeah. He's done punch parry and it hasn't hit once. Yeah. But, but that just shows how confident he is. He's just throwing up gang signs. That's what he likes <laughs> to do. He likes to do it. He's doing a very good job of making Bilal doubt himself as well. He doesn't want to walk in. You see Bilal, he's, he's scared of getting hit by that down 4-2. What uh -oh. nice. a hop Man. Kick. Nice whip punishing. AK's uh, hop kick whip mm. punishing has been crazy today. Yes. Yeah. Oh. And, and the and back the damage. Is surf on him. I mean, this is tough. He's going to have to do something here. Yeah. And he finishes the string. Does it, it doesn't block or duck it. Yeah. Mm. Uh -oh. Man, he's looking for that whip punish, but AK, is he gonna give it to him? 10 seconds left on the clock, he's gotta do something. Oh, oh he has to be careful. Oh! oh. oh. The what he was so focused on landing the ton mix up that he ate the getup kick, and yeah. that's just unfortunate there. Mm. What does oh. is, is Bilal do now, man? Stage select? I think he wants to stage select. Like he's sticking with Brian. Yeah. There's even though he, it seemed like he did worse than that that game. It seems like he's confident in that in that match. Yeah. I wonder why though. I'm, I'm, 
I would, I would love to talk to him just to see like his thought process, especially after what you said, right? Like the fact that you're, you're telling me he's one of the most successful tournament players in Pakistan. I would love to like pick his brain mm. and see how he thinks. Like I said before, that's why I'm really upset I didn't get to go to Pakistan because I wanted to talk to a bunch of the players, see how they feel about certain matchups and yeah. just their play styles in general. It's cool talking to them though because they're, they're their whole outlook on Tekken is very simplistic. Mm. It's so simplistic compared to other people who are like, they, they, they overcomplicate things, you know? But um, sometimes you don't need to, man. Keep it simple. But yeah, can Bilal bring it back? It looks like he hasn't been able to gather much information these last two games. It's been very one-sided, but yeah. we'll see. Shima Doja, though, small stage here for Bilal. But still has one more set though, right? Bilal is not looking too good right now, but yep. this could all be data, right? I mean, it might not be the easiest data to collect, but it's data nonetheless. For sure. Now back to So Bilal playing a very passive playstyle, man. He's oh, trying man. to wait for any whiff punished against AK, but AK not giving it to him. And, and this is the thing, it's like, you don't want AK feeling himself this much. I mean, obviously he's looking right now, he's, he's on the verge of maybe making a reset here. Wow. He's gonna have to be oh, careful man. with the type of confidence that he's giving him here. He's getting Bilal to swing as well, this ain't good. Yeah, it's, it's really crazy because Bilal just hasn't seemed to be, you know, closing the distance all that well. Yeah. Oh, oh wow. my gosh. I think he caught a back there. It's because of that stuff, man. You know, throwing out Hopkins down forward twos and down forward ones the way he's been doing, it's making it really hard for him to get in, even just the one two. Oh my wow. It's all landing. And that was a counter hit. Like, so he must have swung it this. Oh. Switch aside. That was nice. terrifying. <laughs> Rage available. Bilal has to do something. He needs to get around on the board, man. And look how much distance AK is creating. He doesn't care. Yeah, he's chilling. Now three completely whiffs. Quick sidewall, oh, wow. just dashing up. God, he's so brave to do that versus AK. Well, Dancing a little looking bit. Looking for something here. The nice. tackle reversal. Uh -oh. oh no, it's dead. Oh, oh block the last one. Clutch. Oh, oh nice. Uh, he went he tried for it. He, yeah, he tried to get in the air one more time, but look at that. Ooh, one more round for AK to reset the entire grand finals. This is crazy. Won a round, though? He won one round in the first game, I think. Oh, oh my track. god. Completely worked. Actually made me spit in real life right there. <laughs> oh! What was that? That, that was sick! Was that? Oh. With a statement here, and just like that. 3-0 grand finals reset. Now Bilal's and losers. That was the quickest reset I've seen in a while. Like yeah. A long time. But out of a three-round match, three of them If completely. you're Bilal here, what do you do? Do you... Pick Akuma. Do you go back to the character that I would have to go back to Akuma, man. I would. Yeah, I definitely would. I mean, it just depends on how he feels about this set. I mean, because right now, AK is playing out of his mind. Yeah. One thing we can tell for sure is Brian is not working. Yeah, that's definitely true. It is not working. But ultimately, I, I know, like, a lot of times they're like, yo, man, you want to... You have to think about like how you feel, right? But sometimes as a player, that that is can get you destroyed in the tournament. You can legit yeah. be like, no, 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 I got this. And doubling down can get you in trouble. I like Bilal taking his time, yeah. sitting here, sit on it. You got some time. You got to uh, now. You're in the. This is the end game now. Well, the set is about to come to an end, and the LCQ is about to be over. You got to change something. So Bilal has been playing very passively, waiting for an opportunity to whiff punish, and he hasn't been able to get it. Every time he's thrown out the down four two, he's let AK get away mm -hmm. with it. With Akuma. I've seen this matchup before where Akuma can actually whiff punish if he's in the right range with standing two, and it's something that Bilal is good at doing, right? He just hasn't done it yet. So if he can do that, if he can pick Akuma and actually utilize that and make AK doubt himself, then he can win this. Uh, that's the thing is, he's done it before. Yeah. He just has to do it again. I don't know what that first set was. He was obviously feeling the comfort of having, you know, one set to go, but that is gone. And that has gone way faster than we thought it would yeah. be. Yeah, facts. All that's that you can true. see it in Bilal yeah, right now. Yeah, the pressure's the, getting to him. He the, understands. The body language of both of these players right now. All right, Alex has told him, uh, looks like. I think he's going to a coach. Right. Either a coach or, oh, no, it looks like he's about to. <laughs> <laughs> AK is ready to go. Yeah. AK is definitely ready to go. But man, this is an important moment because again, only one of these two players will make it to tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it there all comes is... down to this first, this first to three right here, man. Who's going to be in the Tekken World Tour Finals tomorrow? AK or Bilal, Pakistan or the Philippines? It's definitely going to be a tight one. I can tell you that right now. Yeah. Because AK is looking unstoppable. Mm. He's downloaded everyone's timing so well. I mean, you look at the... Everyone thinks, okay, these hockey are just random. These down four twos is just random. No, he's he's nah. he's reading when you're gonna come Did in. Did you see that last round? That was not random. That, that was, was not random. pure destruction. I yeah. wish yeah. we had stats because his down four two hits like it, he went for he went like 
nine out of ten. Like it was crazy. <laughs> like it was so good. I mean, but look at what it does for him. Like in, in another conversation we were having earlier, it's like those clash of styles. That's yeah. one of the things I love most about watching high level Tekken because we get so many territories that are represented and these styles all clash because each territory plays different. Yep. And I've been trying to tell so many people that. Like people are like, man, why is Tekken so hot right now? Why is the Pakistan thing such a thing? It's because they play completely different. We have these established known styles from every region and once they clash that's the tournament and yeah. this is what you get from it you get high intensity matches like this with some of the best players in the world and some of the upcoming best players in the world my boy ak Bilal, you said before he's in this he's already been in the tournament scene for he's quite sticking some time. to brian oh my wow. god he's sticking to brian no demons today oh damn i mean maybe I mean, it's still three out of five. Yeah, mm. it sounds like it seems like he might have got a little bit of coaching. So maybe he's. I mean, because it seems like he's so confident in this pick. He has how, straight. How from can it. you? You saw how bad it was. Yeah. Of course, but but what else do you have? Yeah, that's it's true. Like, that's true. He beat him with Akuma before, but that was that was also AK's Akuma. Yeah, yeah it was it, the mirror. It, it was the mirror. <laughs> there we go. Can Bilal make the comeback oh, here? What did he get from his coach? Round we'll find out now. Oh, we'll find out what it was. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're about to fire the coach. <laughs> yeah, you only get coach. one, though. You go talk to your coach. Look, man, I'm tapped out. I don't really know what to tell you. Yeah. I'm, I'm going back to the hotel. Me. I'm sorry. Yeah, okay. All right, open stage. Let's see how this is going to play out. But obviously, um, less damage overall for Brian. It's uh, not going to be able to get a lot of the open setups. Yeah. But Shaheen still does decent damage in the open. Oh, oh that wow. doesn't ah. work. That doesn't work. But man, the reactions there from AK. That was nuts. Yeah, and Shaheen gets so much damage in the open now in Season 3. Of every single launch. Mm -hmm. This is the Grand Finals. This is it. The final set of the tournament. Yep. We've, been, we've been at this for almost 10 hours here today. Oh. Or over 10 hours. So much tech in action. Ow. And again... Back, back, four actually hits. Oh my god. Oh my this, god. This is tense. This is tense. Rage drive available. AK threatening it. Ooh. Nice. I like that. I like that from Blau. Just pay, blame well, patient. You know? yeah. And you, you have to remember, even Fun. though it seems like Blau's out of it, right? He's in the lead in the, in the grand finals. Technically, yeah. He, he's in the lead right now. So yeah, I mean, he's definitely being a little bit more aggressive. We saw last time he was not, but you know, Heavy Girl gets counter hit by AK. Yeah, that count, I mean, I swear I've seen so many counter hit get up threes yeah. in this, in this one tournament that I've seen the entire year. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I feel like we, uh, we usually tell new players not to do get up kicks too. <laughs> it's yeah. crazy. It's they're, the timing, man. Yeah, they're watching this like, what? They told us what? They, they told teaching us, us that was bad. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Oh, he's making it super awkward for Bilal now. He's just backdashing. He's got the life lead, huge life lead. Yeah, and he's going to jab him when he comes in. Oh <laughs> my god, he went for the hop. He's crazy. Yeah. Oh. There we go. Finally, he gets a punish on the downfall too. And it's because he slowed down a little bit, right? Not overextending because a lot of times he was getting counter hit. Now he's playing a little slower. He's in rage and only 10 seconds left. Breaks the one plus two. What you going to do, Bilal? He does What's have access do? to rage though. He's going to give him the rage drive and the rage drive. But all he has to do, he needs to get a hit, but there's no time left. Oh, oh, that's a hit, oh, that's a hit, oh, that's a hit. Oh, oh wow. Stolen. stolen. Check your pockets. <laughs> Check your pockets. Good. I still stolen. got my wallet. I still got it. Man, he, he he pulled him there right at the very end. Go ahead, Steve. I know you're feeling it. Yeah. <laughs> you, we'll keep talking. Nice. <laughs> Huge life in the head for AK. <laughs> and he gets the max range again, but just outside of distance there, not able to get the conversion. And that's been problematic. I mean, that's happened quite a few times. Master yeah. of the range, but not on the follow-up. He tried to whip punish it down forward one. Yep. Dancing again, a little bit. He has that life lead again, but he's going to have to be very wary, especially... Oh, oh man. Ooh. Oh, yeah, this is getting tense. Yep. Oh, oh boy. Do it again. Oh, doesn't commit. 20 seconds left on the clock. AK and Rage. Oh, oh. what's the mix-up? Oh, that oh. didn't work. 15 seconds left. Tap on the lane. Oh, pixel of life below. Finally stops the streak and gets the first game of this reset here in Grand Finals. Oh, man. I don't know about y'all. That was the hardest fought three straight rounds I've seen in a long time. Yes. Yeah. Those yeah. were nail biters each and every time. What an amazing feat from Bilal, though, to get body like that with, with Brian and then bring it back three rounds straight. That's, yep. that's impressive. Yeah. But I ain't over yet. I mean, whatever advice he got, he must have been good. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> he won the match. He
He won the match. This is how stressful Tekken can be sometimes. I mean, you need your eyes. Take your fingers out of your no, eyes. This is the first time that Bilal has been on a huge stage like this. With like, this is Tekken World Tour, LCQ. This is for finals, man. Yeah, look, look, you know, man. This is exactly how Arslan looked at Evo Japan as well. Because right, remember, he yep. was winning, and this is what he looked like. Yep. You've seen the thinking man pose. That's his thinking man pose. He just goggles out his own eyes. He's like, oh my <laughs> god, it's so hard. <laughs> oh, but we're back here where we have walls. So there, you're not going to be able to run the whole time. <laughs> wow, what a whip punish again. He, big this, game. this kid is insane. Uh -huh. Yeah, AK, AK's pace in this set has been so nice to see. You know, it's like he'll slow it down, then he'll backdash real fast, and all of a sudden he's doing a slide mix up. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's in the air and he's doing the slide motion. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's crazy. He's buffering the slide motion. <laughs> oh, there it is. Yeah. He heard it. Do it again. There's a low kick. No. Oh, 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 this is big. Oh, no, he missed the follow the up. Big whip. Oh, oh he, he bent it all. Nice, nice. side step. And he's fine. He has four rounds straight now over AK. AK's gonna have to start doing something here. He was playing with so much confidence earlier. I think he just needs that one round. Whatever, I think he just whatever needs that the one coach round. told him is working. Yeah. I mean, you know, he did take the coach's advice, right? And it's also he iced AK a little bit. Mm -hmm. You also have to take that into consideration. Yeah, true. Breaks the throw. Nice confirm. Oh, he has him at the wall too. What's oh. he gonna do? Oh, he caught him with the mid. Yeah. Oh, nice. yeah. He's so good at that. Oh my god. AK's He's always so ready. That. He's just so ready. Oh, running two, that was must have been a mistake. Mm. Mm. Alright, has him at the wall. Rage be careful. Man, look at the decorations Geese has at his place. This is crazy. I would definitely hang out at his house. Yeah. He's Yo, one can of the I play dudes. with this dragon over here? I mean, it can't move, but you know. <laughs> oh! Five rounds straight for Fate Bilal over AK here. Man, it, it, that, that first set looks like a long gone. Yeah. <laughs> that that never was like, happened. I feel like that was last season. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that was last TWT. We still yeah. ain't broken the wall. <laughs> We're about to break one right now. Thanks uh, for telling uh, us. Uh, <laughs> thanks for telling us. <laughs> Shit. Oh, we're about to break another two. One? Oh. Yo, show me some soccer release. I bet you won't break another wall. Oh, okay. I was about to say that took off a ton of damage. It Damn. Did. But this is where Bilal has shot, has started to shine. Every time in rage, he's always been able to capitalize. Rage drive? Doesn't go for the rage drive. Interesting uh -oh. choice. Uh -oh. Oh. Nice. Six, Six straight round. rounds. Straight. Bilal, this is amazing. One match away. Potential last match right here. If Bilal continues playing like this, AK in trouble. You can tell he's a little shaking up up there right now, too. Doing so great in that first set, right? Yeah. But guys, this is Tekken. Is it true? This is Tekken. This is definitely true. You There's know no what block happens. damage in this game, baby. It's all about the play. <laughs> this is crazy the way he got bodied in that last set and he's brought it back six rounds straight. Spangler this is high like level Tekken. <laughs> this is high level Tekken, ladies and lads watching at home. This is some good ass Tekken, man. Hell yeah. This is exactly why I love Tekken. Out of our group here, too, we were having a discussion earlier about who we feel was going to win the tournament. No one picked Bilal. No. Yeah, that's true. So he is really. Uh, Making a name for himself Making here, man. Making a name here. But it's not over yet. AK, if he can get the momentum, we know he's a momentum-based player, he can do this. Yeah, yeah and he, said that. He, la he won the last yeah. set 3-0 three, three too, so yeah. wouldn't be outside of his wheelhouse. And Bilal can't get comfortable like he was last set. He might have a two-match lead, but it's not over. Yeah, for sure. But yeah, he's, you know, he's backing up to the wall. Yeah, there has to be an adjustment here from AK. You know, he can't be playing the same way, obviously, so... Yeah. We gotta see what he does. Wow. Wow. That wasn't even counter hit on the second hit. What yeah. And you can tell right now that momentum is just almost zapped from AK. And it's because Bilal is playing so much slower, taking his time and opening up AK. Seven rounds straight. Bilal is looking like a beast. Two rounds away from qualifying for the Tekken World Tour Finals. Yeah, and again, we got to remind everyone, he is stuck now with Shaheen. He has to use Shaheen for the rest of the tournament. Oh, that's true. He's nice. Walking. Good punish. I mean, Shaheen did a ton of work early on, so I like the, I like the decision. Oh, oh boy. Oh, it's not looking good. What? Whoa, snake Edge? Snake edge. Hell yeah. That was <laughs> <solid>. Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, was I never sick. thought I would see Snake Edge at the grand final. Yeah, that's that's what I'm talking about. I've seen everything. I'm Bucks a Tekken fan. Strats, boy. <laughs> Jimmy, you're on notice. I better see, a, I better see a Snake Edge tomorrow. No. <laughs> oh, he'll do it. <laughs> they, they won't be on purpose, but he'll do it. <laughs> Look at the patience right now. No one wants to make any commitments. AK has a small life lead. Yeah, I mean it's a big, it's a big commitment here. Right yeah. here, this could be, this could be two rounds to none or tied up. Ooh, What's yeah. gonna happen? There it is again. That QCP three. Time's wasting. Oh, oh my gosh, he just threw oh. that out. Five seconds left. The clock. Yo, yo, 
eight rounds uncontested. Wow. Bilal, one round away. Pakistan, will they make it to the finals? Two on the point it. here for Bilal. LCQ point for AK. Fighting oh, back. Oh, he dropped the combo at the wall. Now, bad position. He's going to have to be careful. Yeah, they're down two completely. Oh, man. Oh, nice. Nice. Win punishment. Bilal now playing out of his mind. He's seeing the light at the end of the tunnel. He has a life lead, too. He's seeing that ticket to Sunday. Will he get it though? Will he be able to have that shiny piece of paper that guarantees him a spot oh. in our top 20? Oh my gosh. AK's fighting hard. He's fighting hard. This could go either way. I'm so nervous right now. Oh my <laughs> god. Next kick could do this. Oh. 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 He's in rage now. He's gonna have to be careful. Oh, oh I thought he was gonna clip him with that. I, I thought, thought he was gonna let the rage grab rip. There's only 15 seconds left. There's no time. He's gonna have to make a commitment What's here. He's gonna oh, do oh, yes! Yes! Exactly. It's not over yet! Oh, oh, no! AK stays alive! Barely, is though. Barely. It's not over. It's not over. Definitely not over. That was the first round he's won in a long time. Is this the momentum he needed? Get it, off of it me. It could be. It could very well be the momentum that he really needed right now. Oh, I'll count it. Here we go. <laughs> Give me another match. Oh, there it is. Two. oh no. Drops the, the combo oh, again. Oh. Oh. In the back. No, that was not the back again, though. Oh, my God. Rage available. What's going to happen? One hit could do it for either player. Red dress. Can you oh, use oh it? My oh my god! god. Oh my One god. more hit! Oh oh Fate Bilal will take the LCQ 2019 hair and move into tomorrow's finals. He will be representing Pakistan tomorrow in the finals, ladies and gentlemen. Bilal. Fate Bilal. Oh, Damn. What an amazing set there to finish off day number one. AK resetting the bracket in such a convincing fashion. And then Bilal with a convincing fashion back, man. This is high level tech. We Tekken. haven't sat down for the past two rounds. It's <laughs> insane. It is insane. We have been.